My name is Vera Ngasa. I'm a Supreme Court Justice of Cameroon. Jesus came preaching the kingdom of God. And to me, the kingdom of God is a revelation of systems. We come from a heavenly system where everything is excellent, pristine, and possible. But we live in a world where everything is dead, dying, or decaying, being destroyed or being dissipated. There's so much destruction and chaos around. So we live in this system, but we are not of the system because we've come from a system where everything is excellent. So to me, the kingdom of God is not about preaching or issuing some philosophy. It is taking the practical realities of the excellence of heaven and superimposing them upon the systems of the world. Doing what uh, Genesis 128 says, replenishing, being fruitful, having dominion, replenishing. That which has been dissipated, we are able to put it back. We are able to bring solutions to the problems of the world, the Jesus way. I've been threatened so many times, uh, in many ways. First, there's who does she think she is? Second, these are the women who are going to turn the world upside down. They're coming to upset our society. Don't associate with her, she will mislead you. But then there are those who have actually called me, threatened me on the phone, not really because of women cases, but generally because of the cases I do. I remember one traditional chief uh, came into my office and was waving his uh, traditional uh, broomstick at me, uh, which to them is a symbol of their power and uh, their authority. And so he felt he could frighten me with waving the stick at me. So I'm used to being threatened, but I have a vision of the finish line. You know, Jesus is the author and the finisher of our faith, and he's given us a pattern. And because of the glory that was set before him, he suffered the shame, and because he saw us at the end of it. So I have this paradigm of justice, because righteousness and justice are the foundation of his throne. And the justice systems are meant to set people free. Uh, like Isaiah 58, 6 says, Is this not the kind of fast that I have chosen to lose the band of the oppressed and let those that are downtrodden go free? So that's what I see, using the justice system to set people free, give them solutions, uh, get back the property of this widow, uh, which has been stolen by her male relatives, get this battered wife out of the range of an abusive husband, restore property to a poor man, uh, release somebody who has been unjustly accused from prison. So that's the way I see it. So I don't care. Who did Joseph think he was? Who did Daniel think he was? So I, I'm not the first. No servant is greater than his master. I've been asked many times, who do I think I am? I don't think. I know who I am. <laughs>